Hey everybody, my name is Eugene Cap, and this is Captain Design TV. Welcome to the YouTube channel. Today we're going to be covering one of three videos. The first one is going to be taking a Cinema 4D file of a character and making it actually usable in Element 3D. The second video is going to be taking that 3D model and rigging it in After Effects in Element 3D so it can be animated. And then in the third video, taking that model and putting it into a live scene. Now, I've gone ahead and found this Lego model, uh, very simple uh, character. It's just two arms, two legs, a head, and two hands. So not a ton of uh, actuation points. I downloaded it, and we're gonna go to new composition, 1920 by 1080. I'm just gonna make it uh, 10 seconds long. And I'm gonna go new layer, new, solid. Black layer. And then drop element 3D into it, in, onto the uh, layer. Then I'm going to drop element 3D into the layer. I'm going to go over to your effects control panel, hit scene setup. And I'm going to import this model. Now I have an unedited version of the model and the problem is if I go down to Lego unedited I only have three parts and that's because Element 3D reads the different segments of a model based on the materials that's associated with it. And this is actually very easy to fix. So the first thing we're going to do is open up Cinema 4D, take a look at all the different segments. What I need to do is basically come up with a material for each one of the different points or each one of the different parts of the model that I want to be separately rigged. So I can just go to material one, we're gonna call it head. I'm gonna copy and paste it twice. And I'm going to go left hand and right hand. I'm gonna remove all the models so I can easily identify which one is which. So I can grab material head, drop it on, left hand and right hand. Uh, we have multiple segments with the red material. So I'm going to copy it and paste. And we're gonna call it shirt. Left arm. Right arm. Come on. Right arm. Remove the textures from everything and then reapply so I know which is which and finally we're going to do the same with the blue so we're going to call this crotch left leg And right leg. And then just reapply the textures. Cool. All right, I'm gonna hit save. Yep, let's go ahead and upgrade it. Now if I go back to element 3D, go to scene setup. If we drop down, we now have all the different parts separated. And now it moves into the next phase where we can just uh, take the model, we can set up points for movement, and then we can rig the whole body for animation. So anyway, that completes this first video. If you enjoyed it, 
hit the like button. If you've seen more than one of these videos or plan to go into the rest of the series, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. We're now in a relationship. Let's make it official. I'm Eugene Cap, and this is Cap and Design TV. I will see you in the next video.